sitting down with new men's soccer head coach Chris Apoli as we talk about the 2017 season. Coach, how's the team looked during preseason? Has anything particular stood out to you? Yeah, it's early. Uh, we, we got a late start, comparatively speaking, to, to some of the other teams in the conference in round D3. But uh, everyone's energized. They're excited, um, playing with a lot of passion, which is great to see. Uh, what has stood out, it seems like it's a really good bunch of kids uh, that want to learn, that want to get better, that want to improve in a bunch of areas. So how's the adjustment been taking over as head coach? You know, it's an interesting dynamic because uh, I met about half of them for the first time when we had our first session this week. So everyone has been really gracious in, in the transition and has been open to everything that we're trying to sell with the new era of Del Val soccer. So it's been a pretty smooth transition so far. What are you excited about entering the year? Uh, I'm excited to see the growth and where we start and where we end. Uh, there's a lot of different areas we're trying to benchmark and see where we were in 2016 and, and then where we finish in 2017. Discuss the, uh, the schedule and how you think it will uh, challenge the team. Yeah, our, uh, our conference is obviously highly competitive. Uh, you know, Eastern's picked to win it again. Ms. Cordy, Kings of Sales at the top, Manhattanville. Uh, it, it's a very strong conference. I'm excited to start the conference play, and then the teams are playing out of conference or, or guys I'm familiar with from the CSAC. Uh, so they're teams I think we match up, match up with pretty well. And finally, what are your goals and expectations for the year? So we sat down and, and we looked at some areas that we could improve upon. Our, our rally cry for 2017 is Kaizen, which is a Japanese word for continuous improvement. So we're looking at our home record, our away record, things off the field, raising our GPA, our attendance in classes, things like that. So there's about six or seven different areas where we're looking to improve upon, whether it's, it's how we perform at home, our discipline on the field, how we're doing in the classroom, about six or seven different areas where we're trying to improve.